Okay, so um, here we go. This is the review video of the Antman Racing um, Trikeman Truggy. This is the one it's got Truggy. Now, before I start having a look under the shell, showing you the different things, um, because last time we did this video, the outboxing, it was actually um, the parts coming out of the box. So um, here we go. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to give it to you in um, centimeters. Okay. So, it's coming out at 51 centimetres long. If you zoom in on this part here, you can see it's coming out 51 centimetres long. Okay, now that is from front wheel. That is coming from front wheel to back wheel. If I did it from front wheel to um, back of the main wing here, okay, you're looking at 57 centimetres long. So um, go get out your tape measures and have a look at the length of that. So that is basically the length if you go from front wheel to back of the wing here, 57 centimetres long. So first thing you can see is these big beastly sized wheels here, okay? Um, these ones are 17 millimeter hexes in the middle. We have these nice green um, hex um, screw um, nuts here. I'm removing the shell. There is my temporary thing until we get the receiver. Okay, I'm removing the shell. Let's have a look at the different um, components you can see there. Right, so first thing is you can see we've got the tuned muffler here, okay? This one is suitable for 0.21 to 0.36 engines. This is the limit of the um, engine size that this one can take anywhere, I believe. So, um, here we are, you can see nice tuned muffler going on there. Now moving on to the fuel tank. Um, surrounding the fuel tank we've got these very nice lime green um, coloured fuel tubing lines. This is 125cc fuel tank and holds a nice lot of fuel for um, a nice lot of run time. Okay. On um, turning the car this way, you can see on the front here we've got these big bore aluminum shocks. These ones, the um, shock um, covers here are on wrong way for reason because I had to kind of mod the screws slightly um, so I've had to put them that way around so the nut could tighten in there or the bolt could tighten in there. Okay so um, here we have these big bore aluminum shocks. We have metal shock tower at the front here. Then just below the shock tower we have the differential box front diff sits here, then we have sway bar going all the way round, okay, and with these at the front here are CVD shafts, the latest CVD shafts and good quality. Okay, now moving on here, you can see we've got the um, receiver box and the receiver sitting here we get antenna tube here. Um, if I put it at this angle, I'm sure you can see there we have nice big servo saver as well. And that one is a real strong um, servo saver. Okay, powered by Metal Gear Servo, the steering will be very um, good on that one. Okay, so looking here, you can see we have this very nice. Um, central gearbox. The central gearbox, the spur gear inside there is metal. It is a steel spur gear. This also is double brake pads. We have two brake pads on one side and two brake pads on the other which adds I think the front one controls the front wheels braking, the back one controls the back wheels braking. So very good stopping power there. We've got the um, battery casing here so, and in there you can either put a 6 volt pump pack or you can use your normal 4 AA size batteries of course. And then we have the on off switch with the waterproof um, switch casing here. Going on to the rear side, you can see here we have this nice yellow um, wing or the spoiler sitting here and you can, this is adjustable, okay? This is an adjustable one. Then, same as on the front, on the rear, of course, we have these big bore shocks, also the sway bar, the diff box, 
and um, the aluminum shock tower on that one as well. Okay, so this is a four-wheel drive truggy, and if I hold it off the ground, you can see all four wheels turn, because this is four-wheel drive buggy, and just the same if I um, turn the spur gear, um, which is under there somewhere, there we are, you can see all the four wheels turn. So it is four-wheel drive buggy, and more videos are coming next year. Merry Christmas, and goodbye.